what is up you guys and welcome back to my channel here is a list of things to do while we are bored at home also don't forget to like comment and subscribe and check out my giveaway towards the end of the video it is definitely a perfect time to develop a new skincare routine or to simply just practice some cute makeup looks I'll be going for a simple look today. Staying in the house doesn't mean we can't stay fit. By the end of this quarantine, you will be looking snatched. I've been using Chloe Ting's two-week shred challenge, which is a free online workout program that is super cute and super motivating. I promise you the results are really promising, so you definitely want to go check this out. All right, ladies, it's time to head over to the closet and put together some different outfits. OTD is this adorable floral blouse that I actually forgot about, so I'm so glad that I went digging through my closet. And I just paired it with this golden bracelet. And this outfit is pretty simple, guys, so I just paired it with some leggings. So since we're at home, baking some tasty treats is definitely something fun to do. I'm making strawberry cupcakes with vanilla frosting and funfetti sprinkles. We can use this time to spend time with God, create a worship playlist, and create a Bible reading plan. Spend time in prayer and have a worship session. And of course, let's not forget to wash our hands and drink plenty of water. We can definitely use this time to stay productive. Lately, I've been listening to a self-improvement podcast. You are listening to episode number 248 of the Boss Girl Creative Podcast. You can write down your goals and things to do once quarantine is over. You can also begin journaling or blogging. You can go on Pinterest and put together a vision board for all of your goals. Take this time to learn a new language. You can finally catch up on a reading list. You can organize your closet and set aside some clothes that you'd like to sell online. 
You've probably heard it a million times, but you can definitely use this time to clean your house and get those chores done that you've brushed under the rug. You can use this time to organize your makeup or your purse. One of my favorite things to do is to watch vintage movies. For those of you who want to start a YouTube channel, this is your perfect opportunity. Also, give this video a thumbs up and hit the bell notification. And of course, using TikTok is a must. Oh, and be sure to follow my TikTok. You can use this time to blog, journal, or write a book. You can also use Wattpad, which is a really cool writing community. It's so cute and I use this app so much, it definitely gets your creative juices flowing. I like to go on Pinterest and search yummy recipes to make. I just made some rice topped with chopped vegetables and sausage. It's super fun to get creative. You can learn to play an instrument. I'm currently learning to play my ukulele. I like to knit, so I'm using this time to step up my knitting skills. And this is certainly a time to get back into drawing and painting. You can take this time to discover new music and create a playlist. I'm just using Spotify. You can also catch up on your favorite YouTubers or discover some new channels. 24 hours in my closet and I'm very excited. I think you can do it. Me too. <laughs> and be sure to check out my girl Zoo Royalty's channel. Hello guys, thank you so much for tuning into my channel. And my girl Esther Com. If you're still able to go outside during quarantine, don't forget to at least go out and get a walk in. also play some board games or video games. We all have to organize our phones at some point. So through your photos, your emails, or even plan out your Instagram feed. Go 
Give yourself a spa day and just take the time to relax and unwind. You can put on your favorite perfume, do your nails, or anything that makes you feel pampered. I'm using my spin brush. And let's not forget how relaxing it is to use our favorite bath bomb. so important to take care of yourself especially mentally with the situation that we're all having to deal with and not just ourselves but let's make sure that we're checking up on our friends and family during this time text them facetime them call them even use skype use anything you can to just love on your friends and family and that is the end of my video thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and be sure to check out my video on staying positive during covid19 and join my giveaway for a chance to win some cute prizes